people do not ruin their lives when they don't know what to do. Because when you don't know what to do, you're like, hey, hey, help me. What would I, what should I, I don't know what to do. I'm going to pause. I don't know. People do not ruin their lives when they don't know what to do. They ruin their lives when they know what to do. They're just wrong. Oh, that's a good word there. Welcome back. It is our favorite time of the week, Faith Friday. And that was a clip of our next guest doing what he does best. He is an author, a podcast host, and pastor at Harris Creek Baptist Church. And his new book is asking the question that we've all wondered from time to time, why do I do what I don't want to do? <laughs> and he teaches readers to overcome bad habits by replacing them with good ones. Please help us welcome Jonathan Pacluda. Hey, thank you Nice to see you, Pastor. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so thank good to you. Coming on. You guys. I, I really find this interesting. You say faith often teaches us the don'ts, not the do's. And your book takes us through 10 common vices yeah. and their virtues. That's right. Why this strategy? So like I grew up in church. Uh, I said I had a drug problem growing up because I was drugged to church every Sunday. <laughs> and I, I would sit there and I would daydream, you know, for an hour. And God was the sheriff in the sky that wanted to get me if I did something wrong. And as I thought about the Bible and his word, it's like all these don't do this, don't do this. God wants to steal my fun. But when I started reading the Bible, it actually says the enemy, Satan, seeks to steal, kill and destroy. And that Jesus came so that we might have life. I think as Christians, we often get stuck on defense. Like don't be prideful, don't be materialistic, you know, don't lust, don't do this. But when you begin to read the scriptures, God's actually calling you to something. So rather than being prideful, he's calling you to be hum humble or calling you to humility. Rather than materialism, he's calling you to generosity. So if we begin to pursue those things, I think we find the abundant life that Christ has for us. Oh, I receive that. And you minister to a lot of people, but you focus a lot on those who are in their 20s and 30s. Why those age groups? Well, there's this scripture, it's in, it's in Matthew 16 when Jesus was here and he says, hey, I'm gonna change the world. I'm gonna build this unstoppable force. And Jesus could have grabbed anyone. He could have grabbed toddlers, he could have grabbed the elderly, but he grabbed 12 young adults. And, and he began to pour into them and invest in them. So as I think about the future of the church, I think about young adults, they are the future of the church. And so if you lead a church, you gotta reach the future of the church or else your church is literally dying because we all die. Well, and that's the age you can choose to go to church for yourself. Your that's parents right. aren't dragging yeah. you anymore. And a lot aren't, you yeah. know, and so that's why I'm passionate about it. We ask all of our Faith Friday guests to give us some words of wisdom as we head into the weekend. Oh, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Uh, well, here's what I would say. As you head into the weekend, live the weekend as though there's more than a weekend, that there's an eternity that we're all gonna be somewhere forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. The weekend is short, eternity's really long. And God loved us, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. As you go into this weekend, know that God paid your way in to be with him uh, forever. Mm. That's what I want you to know. He's already paid the way. Come on, he's paid the way. All right. Well, thank you very much, hey, Pastor. Guys, thank I appreciate you guys it. so much. And why do I do what I don't want to do is available everywhere that books are sold. So go out and support him. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.